All right, guys, so we got to go to the other side of town now instead of Irwin. And, you, and the last video I just posted, we had some blizzard conditions for like a minute in Irwin. Definitely the winds were more than uh, 30 miles an hour. It was, it was whipping back, holy crap, like it was really whipping back there. And there were parts where I really couldn't see anything. I had to stop at one point and pull over for about 15 seconds because I couldn't see anything. But um, it's pretty much stopped over there. But now as we head this way, we're heading into more fog now and back into some more stormage. Seriously, I, I, I've always thought people are complete morons when they're walking right along, on, like on the lane, not facing traffic when there's ice and snow. They're just, just idiots, just total idiots. Like, I don't want to see anyone get hurt, but shit, man, like, sometimes some people have to have an example made of them, you know? All right, so yeah, it's getting really foggy over here. Foggy with snow. Okay, it's 31 degrees, 6.54 p.m. in Big Bear. And we're headed over to uh, Boulder Bay, and then we're gonna go to the dam and see how much snow they have. And we might drive around to through, yeah, you know what, that's what we'll do. We'll go around to Fonskin and see that too. Sorry about that, guys. The phone got interrupted by a phone call. You know what, we're gonna unplug it so we don't have to deal with that anymore. There we go. But I know I'm gonna have to deal with this guy going two miles an hour. Great. Oh my gosh, dude. Fifteen miles an hour, huh? Is that is that all we're doing today? Fifteen? straight. So yeah, so we're heading to the part of town that typically gets more, more weather. Yeah. Another 15 mile an hour person. Dude, you do have a Range Rover, bro. Don't you see the commercials? Like you can do all this and then some in that thing. You could probably like flip that thing over and it would still drive fine. <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to be impatient, guys, but when it comes to my um, customers, it's I, it's very, very important to me to to get there, you know, quickly for them. This guy's a Barney. Yeah, we're out of Jeez, man. Right, so we can actually see how much. Okay, I should turn off my brights. I'm gonna let him turn off his first. Oh, he's not gonna turn his brights off. Okay, all right, fair enough. Oh, 
All right, we're gonna shut it off for a moment. Okay. So we're almost to Boulder Bay, where I need to be right now. And then, uh, yeah, and then I got another call, and thank goodness, coincidentally, she's in Boulder Bay as well, so that works out. So I don't have to drive all the way back. So that's fantabulous. Privacy, I gotta shut it off. Peace out. All right, you guys, the delivery I just made over here. Look at how much snow they got over here. Holy crap! Like, they got a lot of snow over here. They got probably six inches of snow over here. Let's see here. Get this thing to focus. There we go. That's, that's what we need right there. Alright, now the next one is just right here, to the left. Wow, look at all the snow they got, guys. Wow. Oh yeah. Flying, bro, flying. And then after this delivery, we're gonna go to, uh, go around to Fonskin. How about that? What you guys think about that, man? Gosh, look at these streets over here, man. Just amazing. Woo! Woohoo! Look at that. Man, that, they got six inches over here for sure. For sure. This person in front of us is having a hard time, but I gotta turn this off for my customer. Peace. Okay, you guys. So I just saw a couple cars trying to make it up this super steep hill and they couldn't. They, they, they were getting stuck right here. They just could not make it. Let's see if I've got the ability in this bad boy to make it up this thing. Wow, it's, it's struggling, but she's going to make it. Wow. Yeah, buddy. Look at that, guys. Look at how pretty this house looks. They're like, stop blinding us. Let's make a U-turn right here. Sorry about that. We were interrupted by a phone call. Another freaking business call. Just never ends, you guys. I'm not complaining. Trust me, because when I first started, um, I was so worried because I wasn't getting any calls. And uh, I had invested a lot of money in, in what I'm doing. I, so I took a huge risk, and I invested everything I had. Sold everything I had. Sold my, my Gibson Les Paul Studio Pro. Sold my, um, my Marshall JVM amplifier the thing was like two grand just for the head and the cabinet was another i think thousand bucks or something or 1500 bucks something like that but guys look at how much snow they got over here it's just so pretty So unfortunately, oh wait, no, we are going to be able to go to Fonskin because, I'll tell you why. Oh, shiza. Because we're almost there anyway. And we need to see what the dam is going to look like. My friend said he's willing to wait for me until I, I get there. So that's good. Look at this deep snow though. Oh, oh, get out there, yeah, get out there. Wow. At least we got a half a foot, you know. I'll take that. A half a foot over here. And you can you can definitely tell that they got six inches over here. My house got half of this. And the further we go over here, look at these walls of snow. They're actually piling up on the side, huh? Now we're looking like a mountain town. Yeah, snow berms on the sides. You gotta love it. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Flame of flame, boy. And 
I wish it was Christmas time so we could play some Christmas music right now. Because this is the kind of weather I've been waiting for. It just makes me feel all Christmassy and happy. Seriously, look at those piles of snow on the side, guys. That's awesome. straight ahead look at how much snow wow I mean obviously the people who live in real snowy areas they always laugh at me when I say stuff like that They're like dude that's not a lot of snow that's nothing we get that when they say there might be a snow flurry <laughs> you know Don't be afraid to use the road, you guys. If you don't see any other cars, don't be afraid to use the road. Be as safe as, safe as you can. Wow, it's just magnificently gorgeous. I was gonna try and go down the hill tomorrow morning. I don't know if that's going to happen. Man. What is that? Clicking sound. Jeez, another one. Watch out, buddy. Dude, these people, man. Woo! Welcome to Be Bear. Alright, let's see here. I'm holding the camera holder steady so the phone doesn't shake and you guys can get good views here. I mean, look at that. That's pretty. Everything up here is just looking gorgeous. So we're coming up to the dam right now. And yeah, this side of town got way more snow than anywhere else like usual. Oh, well, it's not closed. They are letting people by, so that's good. They got chain control straight ahead but they are letting people by. And we're headed into Fawn Skin. Right. That seems to be a pretty long little video, I gotta say. But that's okay. In the time it takes me to upload it, I'm gonna finish the video once we get past Fawn Skin. Dude, what is that sound? Seriously, what is that sound? It's like something clicking underneath the car. Yeah, we don't want to go over the edge. 
switch here. Slow down, Nick. Idiot. Now, maybe if it was live, that would have been kind of cool. I'll take a nosedive over the cliff. Look at how dark it is over here. I think they, there's no power over here. You know what? That's what it is. I'm driving through a bunch of dark areas. That's what it is. There's, they've, they've run out of power over here. See? That's dark. I know what the sound is now. It's the windshield wipers. I'm gonna shut them off and see. It was the windshield wipers the whole time. Can you guys believe it? I am such a dumbass. Oh, there it was. There it was. It's making that sound because there's a big chunk of ice on it. It's 29 degrees, 721. 721 And uh, we have one bar of gas left great there's no gas anywhere near us, but we're not going to run out of gas by then. It's not like it's that far. <laughs> okay, we're getting some, some power over here. Just looked like the power was out back there, but I could have been wrong. Okay guys, so this is Highway 38. And then in a few miles it turns into Highway 18. Weird, I know. Still, this was a weak snowstorm. I mean, three inches at my house? I mean, come on, dude. Lame, lame, lame. But it does make everything look really pretty, so I'm happy about that. At least we got that. Uh-oh. Slow down, buddy. So the part of town that got the most snow was over at the dam and uh, Boulder Bay area. Which if you guys watch my videos all the time, you 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 know that I, I tell you guys this all the time. 
so when you come to town, if you want to stay where it's going to snow more when we have a storm, try and stay as close as you can to the hotels closer to the dam. Or Airbnb is closer to the dam. The closer you get to the dam and, and Boulder Bay areas, the more snow you're going to get. Alright, so now we're in downtown Fonskin. Don't blink, folks, or you will miss it. Don't sneeze, don't blink, don't get up to go get a beer, nothing. Patrol guy. Good thing I turned off my brights. It was good. I don't want him to get mad at me. I'm telling you, I am so good at driving these roads. It's sickening. It's sickening, I tell you. Sickening. I should be one of the snowplow drivers up here, I'm telling you. I'd love to be. I think that'd be so much fun. Imagine the awesome videos I'd be able to do on a snowplow, you guys. Holy crap. Snowplow's moving pretty good. I'm impressed. That would be like me driving one of these for them. Uh oh, uh oh. The only place I've had any accident in this town was this next turn in my Mercedes 500. It's a 10 mile per hour turn. It was really icy and I wasn't paying attention. I took it at like 25. Like right here, I was like, oh shit, I'm going too fast, damn it. And uh, as soon as I turned my wheel, I just slid straight across the road into that ditch. Right there. That was heart wrenching, I'm telling you. see across the lake it looks so beautiful right now guys I don't know if, if you guys can tell but this looks spectacular across the lake that snow summit over there those orange lights and there's some hotels right there on the water man it just looks beautiful just gorgeous guys So we're going to shut it off now. But thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. I love you guys very much. It's 28 degrees in uh, Fonskin, Big Bear area. And it's uh, February 4th, 2019 at 7.30 p.m. on the dot. Latest.